The Arda Chalice, 8th century AD. It is impossible to walk past this magnificent chalice without being struck by its beauty and intricate metalwork. It is made from spun silver, gold, copper, bronze, lead and precious stones. The underside of the base of the chalice is also intricately designed with a polished crystal in the centre. The craftsmanship and skill of the work is so exquisite and detailed that experts believe several metallurgists were involved in its creation. It comprises three parts, the cup, the stem and the base, held together by a copper bolt with over 300 parts. The names of 11 apostles and St. Paul are inscribed beneath the gold filigree band surrounding the cup. The cup is part of a hoard found in 1868 by two local boys, Paddy Flanagan and Jim Quinn, who were digging up potatoes in a field. The field was owned by Mrs. Quinn, who later sold the chalice to the Bishop of Limerick, George Butler, for £50 who then later sold it to the Royal Irish Academy for £500. The chalice was hidden under a stone slab along with other treasures, and it is thought that the owners meant to come back to retrieve their hoard, but that some misfortune befell them. Paddy Flanagan remained in Arda and is buried in a pauper's grave in Newcastle West. Jim Quinn emigrated to Australia and died in Melbourne in 1934, he is buried in Faulkner Memorial Park. The chalice is on display in the National Museum of Ireland in Dublin.